Hey everybody, welcome to the Rangers of Shadow Deep Battle Report. I'm here with Spencer, Ethan, and Evan, and we're going to be throwing down um, the sort of finale to Incinerator, a, a two-part mission for Rangers of Shadow Deep that Joe wrote as an expansion. So in this one, the Rangers have been captured. If you haven't seen the previous mission, you can go up here in the cards and check it out in the playlist. Um, and they've escaped from basically where they've been left to die in a collapsing lava-filled room, like like Dr. Evil's lair or something like that. And busting through a doorway, they, uh, they have to form a prison break. They find basically a group of guardsmen outside the, the lava pit that they're being chucked into and there's a whole bunch of doors to go through to try and figure out the way out. So we'll show you the table, we'll show you the current state of the rangers and we'll get this underway. So here's the surviving rangers and companions from the last mission, um, which was the fire drop. So we've got uh, Lord Greyfax in the middle there with his two companions and new guardsman buddy that they found who was bleeding death in there. We've got a ranger named Slickback, I guess I have the whole name, like a tribe called Quest, and his uh, nameless recruit. And then we have Stefan Wolf and Twilight, the war kitty, mm -hmm. ready to rock and roll and do some murdering. Uh, so they've busted in this room, busted the door down, like cop style, uh, and they find eight doorways, all of which can be opened by spending an action to get into contact with them. They find some uh, cultisty looking um, defenders. These are like the baddies that are, that are holding them hostage right now in this dungeon. And a couple of archers that are in the corner. Uh, now these monsters are so surprised by the appearance of three rangers heavily armed from a room that was supposed to be filled with lava at 1214, um, and during the normal lava clearing, I guess, like, portion of this dungeon adventure, uh, that they don't get to activate during the first round. So no actions for creatures this round. They'll have the total element of surprise. Now, there are two decks. There's an event deck, which we won't use in the first turn, and a doorway deck. So the doorway deck, one card in this deck reveals the exit door. Um, and that is shuffled with four cards at the bottom of the deck, and then four remaining cards are on the top, and they will have to open doors and go through this doorway deck until they find the exit. And once they do, they will escape. But until then, other rooms could be revealed, other monsters could be inside them, and it can all go horribly wrong. So Ranger Face turn one! Where are we going? Yeah, I think Lord Greyfax is just gonna run in. Do, his, do what he his, does? That's that's just what he do. Uh, we're gonna group activate with his long-suffering manservant. That's right. Uh, he needs a name. We'll get him one eventually. Uh, I think Woodhouse should be his name. You know, we'll, we'll put it on the list. Right. Stabs with yeah. the manservant or with yourself? Uh, we'll go with Lord Greyfax first. Okay. So it'll be flight plus seven. Plus seven with the gang of bonus. That's a 20. Uh, to a, that is a 18. So you will just, I think, slay that guy. 10 health and 10 armor. You do get a second action in your manservant now. Uh, yeah, I think he will just, uh... You know, engage that guy if you yeah, want. I think, I think we will. And then another him. ranger can go fight him, yeah? Cool. All right, what's, uh, this is the next ranger that's going to go. Can I go? Well, yeah, what do you what do you want to do? You I think he wants to shoot. Uh, yeah, I'm right, just using my crossbow go shoot right next. Cool, go for it. Alright, cool. Uh, Not going to move first, because that way you don't have to get the hit penalty. That means that your second skill could be to reload if you want. Plus three, yep. so you got a 19. There we go. That's going to do it. So that archer is plus one. Uh, his armor is, I believe, 11, but you are plus two because you have a um, crossbow. crossbow, which means you're 21. Mm -hmm. I'll just kill him 10 hit points. So action to reload the crossbow. Yep. And did you want to group activate your kitty? Uh, or just wait for later? I, I See what I the monsters wait do? For now. Wait for cool. now, for sure. And then it's uh, ranger name Slickback. All right, are we going to go. This is eight, right? Yeah. So we're going to go. Can you go touch the door? Seven. Not quite, so you're going seven, yeah. yeah Screw activation, activation yeah. Gonna... And then second skill? Oh yeah, his second skill. He's you get in contact with this turn, yeah. Cool. Wow. Monster phase just gets skipped, so we go immediately to the companion phase and they get to do stuff. Yeah. Uh, we'll go with our new man-at-arms, and he's just gonna go walk into combat and support our other... Hey, what's up, tattoo brother? Uh, the stabs, so the yeah. man-at-arms is plus three, plus five because of the gang up on this, to plus two. Ooh. Eight. Uh, I'm oh. afraid I have bad news. Um, so he is a double-handed weapon, which means he's about 21, and that's just going to kill the new man-at-arms. Uh, next companion, you get your kitty, and you got your other recruit. What could possibly go wrong? Yeah, try again. If, yeah. if at first you haven't sent enough minions, try try again. So you're plus five again? Yep. Jeez. Can't possibly go wrong. <laughs> I mean, you it might you... just get worse. Nah, he didn't hurt you this time, though. All right. And now it's Stefan Wolf's kitty, Twilight, gets to go and do something. Uh, gonna shoot that other archer. No, it's Your the... kitty? Oh, he has never a gun? mind. Come jump in. Uh, the fascinating. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you go, gang, go touch, you go touch a door. Gang, bo gang bonus with the uh, other recruits. Yeah. Or go touch a door. Yeah, I think I'm going to. Just go, go like explore. Go. Be, yeah, be, exactly. be a, an interested animal. Yeah. All right, well, top card of the door deck is going to be. The seven. You find a larder. The room is filled with rotting meat. Remove the door and replace it with a giant fly. All right, campaign phase over, and there's no event phase round one, so it just skips right back to the ranger phase. Awesome. Look, Greyfax is going to go go murder some folks. Yeah, he's going to group activate with his uh, man at arms. Man at arms, and then he's just going to 
Walk around, get into some combat, go four, and then another two. Just come behind. Just, just make it pay attention to you while I do this. Wave your arms, wave your arms. All right. Uh, yes, yeah, so we'll first action attack with the uh, man at arms. Cool, go for it. You're going to be plus seven? Yeah. Ten? You win, but right. you don't do any damage. Yeah. Right. Any great facts? Yep. Uh, yeah, we'll just be fight plus nine. Get him. That's better. 21. Mm, not enough. That's going to kill him. Giggy the Great Facts, Big G! Uh, so then it's next Ranger. Who wants to go? Uh, I'm gonna open this door. You can explore? Alright, let's flip the next card. It's the two. The door and put Gorbin the Ogre in place. The figure that just opened the door should make a leadership TN8 roll. If successful, Gorbin joins you. If not, treat him as an evil creature and he tries to kill you. TN8, now you can continue to try and make these rolls to convince him until he, can, he joins you. But otherwise, yeah, he's gonna be, he's gonna be a bad guy. So plus two. So crushes it. Gorbin the Ogre is now a member of your warband. It's oh, yeah. an action though, so you can still walk around and do something if you want. Uh, he's gonna shoot your crossbow. Mm, yeah, I'm gonna shoot my crossbow at the table guy. All right, cool. Actually, uh, uh, can I shoot Archer dude on the other far side? If you want, he's, yeah. he's just he's hard to be super secure. Actually, he'll probably be easier to hit because there's just intervening terrain then as opposed to hard cover. Mm. All right, let's go for him. And I'm shoot one. Oh, sorry, plus one. So I'm shoot two. Plus cool. Two. That's an eleven. Mm, not good enough. Uh, so it's a crossbow, which makes it a 13. He's armor 11, so two points damage. He'll have uh, eight left. All right, uh, and then next and last is going to be over here. We've got your uh, Inquisitor, or sorry, Inquisitor, your <laughs> Ranger, um, yeah. Stefan Wolf. Uh, you could also shoot your crossbow if you want. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to do it on the Archer guy. Okay, he's training the way, so he'll gain a plus one to be plus two overall, and you'll be plus three, I think, because you shoot yeah, plus three. I got to shoot plus three. That is, that is not the number you want. Awful. Wanted. All right, well, that's uh, that's going to be the ranger phase. So we're on to some creatures, starting with the one in melee. That fly's going to fight your kitty. Yep. Plus one? Oh, jeez. <laughs> kitty, kitty says sit. <laughs> that, was, uh, that was spectacular. Uh, so the next closest model will be over here. How to get one Easy to come around and fight Grey Fox. Yeah. Come have some stabs. Plus two to your plus five. Your 19. To four, so that's nine. I got a two handed weapon, so two handed weapon, so that's gonna be a 21. He's armor 11, which will just kill him with 10 points. He ran directly into the sword. Hey, you uh, and last but not least, he's gonna shoot Great Facts with a bow. Give me your moment. So, uh, your fight plus five to shoot plus one. 23, that seems good. So, yeah, no, it just misses. All right, companions. Yeah, uh, I'm just gonna have my uh, recruit start uh, walking towards the door. He'll go three and three, not quite make it. And then move second and go again. Yep. Just get back into base. Cool. Where's Gorbin going? Hmm? Oh, I'm gonna get my recruit out of the way first. Or, uh, my didn't you walk her over? There? Oh no, you didn't move. No, uh, not, not, right. not, uh, not this turn. You didn't activate with me. All right, let's um, see what get over the door. Hey, <laughs> number four. Empty room. Nothing of interest. Who gets to go? He'll walk five. Can you uh, can you go around? It's fine. Yeah. yeah. Probably four then because of rough terrain. Yeah, rough terrain. I just have to dip in and out. And then you can move again and go two and a half. Oh yeah. All right, uh, and that's just Kitty. Yep. What does Kitty want to do? Uh, go sniff a door again. Start running, or I guess I can. Yeah, for sure. That one. If you want. Yep, for sure. Can I just say that is there? Do it. Yep. All right. You find number five, which is. And I'm doing sigh of relief. There's nothing in this room. <laughs> All right, event phase. Let's see who is showing up. Seven. Place a giant fly in front of the entry door. Another fly shows up. Someone from last mission that was flying across the lava. He just showed up finally. Uh, <laughs> and so now it's ranger phase of round three. Great facts. Gonna go back to with your group. Yeah. Uh, so we're just gonna go seven. Then we'll go another three and a half and engage. Cool. And then he'll just move, move as well. But not quite. Make it. Go nine. No. What do you want to do, uh, Stefan Wolf? Uh, yeah, shoot a shoot a bug. I'm gonna actually uh, use hold creature on it. Oh, cool. Yeah, to kind of freeze it so that freeze I have for the time turn. to move and kind of run away. And okay, so you can move first and then hold creature on it if you want. Okay, actually, uh, if you move, I'll just shoot it. I'll, I'll reload and then shoot. Yeah, but then we, we have more time to like search other doors and like, it's other true. Enemies. So take a walk first, and then to throw yeah. the whole creature down, so that guy can't move during the creature phase. No, all right, slick back. What are we doing? Uh, we're gonna group activate with the uh, unnamed swordsman and <laughs> the unnamed swordsman. Yeah, okay. Uh, sorry, the swordsman uh, that has been renamed to just recruit. I was gonna call her. I was gonna call her Stabatha. Yeah, I think that's a good name. Uh, uh, you know what? Uh, when she becomes a ranger, she'll be a, her name will be Stabatha. Excellent. Excellent. All right, well, let's see what's in the door. 
It's number three. Warden's office. Place a six by six room behind the doorway. Place a desk in the middle of the room and place the warden behind it. Place a treasure token on the desk. The warden's office. Oh man, he's so mad that you got out of his lava trap. He spent months building that lava trap. <laughs> it takes like a million goblins just to reset that lava trap and he is pissed. So this is the, uh, the encounter that you're currently in. That was your second skill. Mm -hmm. uh, but you can do a second skill with Stabith still. Jeez. Do you want to go in the room, fight the boss? Yeah, she's going to step in just so that she's the target. Nice. Not, uh, nice, good leadership skills. Yeah. Quality leadership skills. <laughs> all right, well, it looks like the uh, the rangers have all gone, so it's creature phase. Uh, we'll start with him on contact, and he's going to fight you. Fairfax takes a... Oh, jeez, just, just, just showing people who's boss. That was 19, 24, 26 total, so did 13 points of damage. Uh, and then it's going to be frozen, so we can't do anything. Mm -hmm. And then over here, he's going to move six and come fight. Let's move six, fight four, um, two hand weapons. We fight five, and oh, she's sorry, that's a frost grave roll. Just fight four, uh, and uh, armor eleven, I think, with twelve health. So let's see what happens. Fight and three, fight plus four, fight plus four. thirteen. Uh, it's going to be eight, so thirteen uh, with swordsman it means that he'll take two damage, and if you can push it back, if you want, a ten. Phase is done. Uh, remaining companions, I think it's just the big ogre I've and Kitty, yep. and then yours over here. Yeah. Who wants to go first? Oh, I'd have to go around my guy. You would, yes. You won't be able yeah. to fit right now. Oh, you yeah, go over there. And punch the punch the bug. I wanted to it. fight the boss, so okay. I'm going to mosey him. In just stand him. stand over there. So he's he'll be able to walk in. Right yeah. Go yeah. back to me later. Yeah. Door. Yeah. First action. What's in the door? What's in the box? Eight. Bone store is here. So second action, you could go inside, you could wait for him to come kill you, but there's a treasure token in there. You could also yeah. run away. I think that there's a cat that looks like you could take a shot for us. <laughs> so we're just going to walk slightly farther take back. Take the team? Oh my what? god. So so dark. So dark. All right. <laughs> Poor kitty. What? Um, so it's on to uh, kitty. Kitty can do something if you want. Uh, can you even run back to uh, his best friend? <laughs> just, just be like, I hear noises in there. Yeah. It's all done. Uh, and so I think that's all the companions. No, because he double moved with the group activate, and that's it. So it is event phase. We get a three. Scout appears in front of a random unsearched door. So these two, so one to ten, eleven plus. This one right here. Here comes skeletons. Group activating with Slickback and Stabitha, and they're just going to go flank the boss here, waiting for Morbin the Ogre to come in. Bop, bop. And who wants to strike first? Uh, let's go with Stabitha. She is fight three, goes to five, because you got a gang up on us. What could go wrong? Mm, ten? ten? I have bad news. <laughs> <laughs> well, she's dead 22, again. she dies again. <laughs> Your boss gets to fight. Yeah. Any um, skills you want to use? Uh, three versus fight four. Twelve? Mm, Fourteen. So... Uh, you're going to take armor 11, 3 points I'm actually damage. armor 12 because he's a shield. So 2 points damage. 18 points left, and it's next ranger. Yeah. Um, Lord Grayfax will go. Um, so we're going to group activate with oh. our... Oh, never mind. Companion phase opened this. I was wondering why he hadn't activated. Go ahead. Um, so he's just going to move up to the door, and then we'll have Lord Grayfax kind of walk past him. <laughs> to and, safety. Uh, and he'll push the button. And see what's there. It is door number six. Armory. Place six by six room. Place a special treasure token in the corner, in both of the corners of the doorway. Uh, figure with these tokens manage to exit the table. They may exchange it uh, for rolls in the weapons and armor table. So two treasure tokens that can be picked up, and if you do it, you get an automatic roll in the armor and weapons table. Yeah. So last ranger. Uh, Grayfax still has a second action. So oh, she's going to go in the door? She's going to go in the door. Oh, hello, shiny things. Only one door remains, and the last ranger is, of course, um, over here. What are we going to be doing there, Stefan Wolf? Uh, trying to figure out, should I shoot the skelly, the thing, or try to come in here and start fighting this? Well, I don't think either one of those will be able to attack you, so... Well, no, but like so I, I could be well, helpful. You, but you That's could true. Mo you could move towards one, kill it, and then the other two won't be able to reach you next turn. True. You know I, mean? I don't even have to move. I could just shoot it and reload. True. That's what I'm trying I to shoot. Buzzy the fly or the skeleton? Probably skeleton. Skeleton's easier to kill. Yeah. He'll be running after him. That's true. He doesn't need any more. That ogre's been locked up for days. Yeah. Give him a break. I like it. So uh, that is definitely a dead a dead skeleton because nice. that is sixteen total and Plus he only fight one. Yep. I can actually reload. Yep. Cool. Is the kitty gonna group activate? Uh mm, You would have done no. so already if, if the no. case, okay. Yeah, yeah, no. Alright, so that's all the rangers. Uh, let's do some monsters, starting with the closest, which will be I think this guy. He's gonna walk his five, because he's a skeleton. Oh. And then two and a half more. And you can snap if you want, but you won't quite make it. 
I'm going with the kitty. Nope. Okay. Wow. Uh, then it's going to be the buzz. Uh, it's going to go for you. So it's going to be this and then four, but not get to fight this turn. And then we forgot about him. We're going to fight you. The Hi. warden. Warden's going to fight. What you got there? Slick back. Oof. Plus three. Yep. You're doing great. Oh You're doing so great. 16 uh, to 12, so armor 12. Yeah. Four more damage. Uh, I mean, he's got 18. He's only he's got 14 uh, left. He's not, yeah, still, he's not super hurt. Yeah, and a 14. In phase, you can send the ogre in. Yep. I figured. 100%. Boop. Yeah. Arm, so he's at plus one overall for fights. Does he get plus two for gang? Nah. Oh, plus two for gang, yeah. Yeah, so it's plus, yeah, three, plus three overall. Oh, 18. <laughs> you got him. So he is 18, 20 from the armor. Or 20 from the. Uh, or sorry, actually, he doesn't have a weapon. weapon. So he's just 18. Mm -hmm. um, and that means armor 11, seven points of damage. We've got three left on the warden. He also minus two damage, my bad. Minus two fight and damage. So you have five left. So the creatures, so companions remaining, it looks like. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have my recruit trump in to help. Fight with Kitty? Yeah. Go for it. Thank you. Fight plus two is a fight plus four. Yep. Fight three for the bone ogre. Oh geez, 20. Nice. Ugh, I'm sorry, 21. Aww. I have bad I have bad news. You have uh, you have failed to yes. Uh, critical existence failure. <laughs> Kitty, what would Kitty like to do? Uh I guess it's gonna paw it. Just get potter, right? <laughs> five plus one. Five plus yep. one. Five plus three. Mm. I also have bad news. Mm. Uh, extremely dead cat. Well, that was round. Uh, so the ace shows up, and that's a fly in the middle of the room. Phase. Who's going first? Uh, I'm gonna group activate these. Yeah, with the ogre. Yeah, the ogre uh, makes sense. Gonna go first. Ogre's gonna fight. He'll be plus, plus three, three overall. Yep. Uh, Sixteen. To a 14, so you're gonna hit him. Uh, so 16 so minus five. Of five minus two though is three. Oh, yeah. Because yeah. of his bang on armed, which means he'll have two left. Sweet. And now my ranger. Stab with the boss. When he is fight three plus two for. Yep, so five oh. overall. Oh, that's yeah. 20. Uh, that's a 16, you're gonna kill. Ooh. Did it! it is, so. he, he can. Uh, no, you burn your first right? skill to move him in. Oh, no. uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, so that's it. Right here. What you doing there, Stefan Wolf, or does uh, Greyfax want to come back and help? Well, Greyfax has got a really simple turn. Uh, he's going to group activate with his manservant. And they're both going to grab treasure. That's what I figured. I'll go over and pick up treasure. I like the team cohesion here. I like the teamwork. I like the, I like the real vibe overall. What, what are we doing over here, Sean? Okay, yeah. so I got a bit of a plan. Yeah. So uh, I'm going to move. You can't move when you're engaged. You have, to, you have to win combat first. Dang it. Okay. Well, I guess I gotta hit him. Okay, fight him. It's two. To fight plus zero. Uh, you did not win. So, but doesn't no damage to you. Because it's only nine points. Like the Rangers are done. So, once again, I have bad news. Uh, first of all, the bug's gonna fight you. You're fight plus two again. Fight plus zero for the fly. Ten. Ugh, 13. Um, so, you are armor, what, 11? Yeah. Take two points. He remains. Uh, then this fella comes in. And says, hello everyone, I am 5 plus 5 now. Oh boy. 5 plus 2 to 5 plus 5. It's getting real sporty over there. Uh, ah. <laughs> okay, 22, 11 more points. So you go down to 6. So you go down to 4 because he counts as being armed with a double hand weapon. Oh, of course. The last blood comes in and it fights you. He. Yeah, he does. Wow. Uh, and then it's going to be 5 plus 2 against 5 plus 4. No. You win! Kill it! Because that's not to kill it. Yeah, you okay. 14. No companions left. Uh, so it's a vent phase. And we get the six. Select one random hero. That hero has stepped into a metal grate and a ghoulish hand is grasping him. The hero must make a move roll at TN18 or a strength roll at 16 or be unable to make any move actions this turn. Each turn after this one, it may spend an action to repeat the roll um, with a plus four to each roll after that. It's sorry, plus four to the roll if another hero is within one inch. On so the there's five on the board. So we're going to go clockwise starting with Greyfax like this. Okay. And it'll be uh, one to four for the first one, and then five to eight, etc. Five to eight. So it's going to be your little man at arms here. He's got a ghoulish hand on him. I'm gripped. Uh, and it's Ranger face. All right, gonna start off with the Ranger. Those Lock the door. And now he's going to use his first magic his, bolt. Of his, the his, round. his magic bolt. He's going to go Hadouken. All right, so whoa, before you're rolling dice, get oh. out of here. Oh, uh, you got to randomize. So right. uh, one and two is your friend. Three, four is the ogre. Five, six it's the bug. D6. Five, six is the bug. Yeah. All right, so magic bolt into the bug. And you're plus five. Yep. 11 uh, to six. So you do five points of damage and kill it. It's only number six. Oh, a and who's next? Uh, I guess I'll go with Grey Fox. Um, so he'll group activate with the uh, man at arms. Okay. Uh, 
So there was a test I had to make. You right? make a 10, 18 move or a 16 strength. All right. Uh, well, we'll do a move check. Uh, okay. He's move six. He's fine. Gets it. Breaks the breaks the grip. So we're just going to move back into the central room. It's going six. And great facts goes seven. Oh, so slightly wow. more. Mm, seven. Second wow. second action. Uh, Second action, we will just uh, watch him steal hop the into, <laughs> Hop into the combat and help cool. out. <gasps> so nice of you. Yeah, I mean, had to do some teamwork. About There's another treasure token over there that no one's picked up, so you know. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> there are things to be done. Uh, so it looks like it is time for monsters. They'll fight the thing with the lowest health, so unfortunately, Ethan is still the target. Uh, he is our plus two fight, so he's fighting oh, four now. Ranger phase thing yet? Yeah, but, but and you can do it right now. That's right. Yeah, before it attacks you, it's the same roll. Yeah. So you get a, you get a swing. You're four to it's three. Fourteen? Seventeen. I'm afraid you have you have walked into the longest dark. You're knocked out, you have to make a roll, you're at zero right now. So you'll make a, you'll make an injury roll at the end of the game. Okay. <laughs> and now it fights him. Hey! No. So, uh, I'm going to do Deadly Strike. Furious Assault, Whatever strike, yeah. Whatever gives me plus five. Plus five. Plus ten. Ooh. Fourteen. Uh, to nine, so you do hit it, and fourteen, I think, might kill it. Just enough to kill it. <laughs> All right, that's that's gonna be. You got you got just Morbin the ogre left. Where's yeah. he gonna go? He's gonna. Oh, but that's supposed to be on him because he hasn't reloaded. That's right. Yeah. Crossbow yet. Um. Yeah. He's walking over, picking walking it up, around, picking it up. Cool. Boom. Event phase. It's gonna be an eight. He's a skeleton in a random corner of the main room. So one to five, and we'll go clockwise. Fourteen. It's gonna be over here. Phase. All right. Uh, Grayfax is just gonna. Start moving towards the exit. I'll go six. And then, le well, he Seven. has to actually find the exit yet, but you know, you know it is. And then we'll walk into the Walk into base space, yep. Yeah. Head nine the other way, just ignoring the skeleton. And then the skeleton will come towards you. I'm going his six, I guess we just go around this. So six and then three. Up there. Okay, where are you going? Uh, with the door? Uh, what's the speed five? Yep. Yeah. So. And then you can go two and a half if you want. It'll stop to you. Uh, I won't fight you this round. Yeah, sure. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. He's not going to do that because I'm going to shoot with him. Uh, shoot next turn? My ranger next okay, turn. Okay, gotcha. Event phase <laughs> nine. Event occurs. So next round. Your phase. Yeah, Grey Fax will go. He's just going to hop over the uh, debris here and uh, engage the skeleton. Sweet, go on seven. Five against fight one. Uh, 20? Yeah, no, I said that skeleton. What you doing there, Ranger? No, uh, you just moved me nine. Absolutely. Mm, eight and one, so you're just in the door. Oh, shit, crap, he's speed seven. because he's speed seven, so he's on the other side keep of the door. Forgetting, yeah, That's uh, fine. The speed. <laughs> Companions? Uh, yeah, may as well catch up to my, the my door? homeboy. The door? Just stand next to the door. Yeah. You you're about to leave, this is, this is the exit door. Oh, yeah, well. Might, there might be a monster, you're right, yeah. You might want to go in the middle of the thing, five. You hear a mighty crash from the fire drop room behind you and the whole building shakes. Every figure, including evil creatures, make an acrobatic test at TN12 when it activates, and if it fails, they get no actions next turn. Ranger phase! Alright, TN12 acrobatics test. Who wants to go first? Oh, I'll go. Can I take acrobatics? Uh, facts has acrobatics plus three. You're Easy. fine. Um, yeah, we're just gonna turtle back to the door. Cool. Can I open it? Uh, yeah, we'll open it. Cool. It is, hey, to no surprise, the exit door. Wow. All right, TN12 acrobatics. <laughs> nope, you wow. lose all your action. No monster on the table, so it's just companions. Yep. Uh, you want to roll for him? Absolutely. TN12. Nope. Fails. Uh, for Morbin. Passes. You can go somewhere if you want, or you can have him leave. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to have him move closer to him in case more monsters spawn. With all right, and that's turn. So next event, four. There's a skeleton in the random corner of the main room. So again, one to five, and then clockwise, it's going to be over here. Good looking out, Morbin. He's just gonna leave? Yeah, yeah. we're gonna group back to Peace it. out! <laughs> Leaving okay. Slick back to his fate. <laughs> He's gonna walk over and pick this up. Yep. Seven, we're gonna get the treasure now. Woo! And then it's Morbin against the world. This guy's gonna go his nine and get into melee. And then Morbin can fight if you want. Yep. All right, fight one against fight one. It's a slap fest. Oh, sorry about uh, you win though. Ironically, uh, you're minus two to damage, so you don't actually kill him. And just doesn't know what to do with this. So uh, that's going to be end of round. Final event card. Two. Giant fly and a random door. So the only remaining doors are one, two, three, four, five. So one to four going up clockwise. It'll be this one right here. It'll be this one right here. The exit. Bzz. All right, turn. 
You got the tape measure. Want to move ten? Oh, does Morbin want to fight? We forgot to fight Morbin last oh, yeah. round. Oh yeah. He can actually. Oh, he can fight too. Yeah. Yes. Uh, yes. Yeah, so uh, you take. I'm at minus one. No, I'm at. You, you're at remember. you're at one. So you're at uh, eleven, and then the skeleton gets a sixteen. Your armor eleven, so you can take five points of damage. You got three left. Because he was wounded at the start of this. It's Ranger phase, and it's all you slick back. Just gonna come come to the rescue. Whee. Yep, speedy okay. boy. Get in melee. Then the creature will activate and attack Morbin because he had the lowest hit points. But Morbin's plus two now, so he's fight three. Eight oh. to eleven. Uh, that is not enough to do any damage to him though. He's armor twelve. Morbin could attack if he wanted to. We fight oh, yeah, three. Still fight three. Uh, yeah. Let's fight three. Why not? May as well. Don't die. Whoa. There you go. Crushes it. All right, so there you go. You just crush skeleton. He got mad finally. Second skill, he could actually move if he wants. Uh, oh, the fly too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The fly would have gone in. Oh, yeah, yeah. Zzzzt. And then stabs. Let's fight zero against Morbin. Fight one. Sit, fly. No event cards left. That's going to be game. You're going to leave the table and roll for some injuries. All right, so first survival rolls. Let's see who's uh, who's dead and who's alive. So rolling for Stabitha. Oh, yeah, I forgot she died. Don't die. Uh, she's oh, dead. Cool. Like, literally, actually dead. Well, I got Morbin, so. <laughs> All right, and then um, your recruit. 11 for recovery. Sweet. And then for Twilight, the kitty. Don't die. Don't die. 10 for recovery. Last but not least is Steppenwolf. What do you got, Steppenwolf? Uh, Don't die. For recovery. Just, you were just winded. You were just winded. Yeah. You're fine. 64 experience earned for everybody leaving the table and for recruiting Gorbin and all the other fun stuff that happened. Um, and let's go on to, that's not any, any 150 level at this point because we're all level 6, so not quite there. Um, but let's see what we got for your treasure. So an automatic roll on the armor and weapons table because of your special treasure token. Nine, that's going to be a throwing knife. Yeah, fancy. Literally the worst possible rule. You thought um, you get that for selfish. <laughs> it's true, you get for like different dinking around. Exactly. Uh, it's like, it's just nickel plated, it's not even silver. Nah. So uh, for your treasure token, what'd you get? Two golden jewels. Uh, that's an automatic 10 XP. And then for you, because you got one as well, didn't you? I did not. I didn't oh, that's right. No, I was running did you get two? Oh, you got no, two. I, I got, oh, well, two, got two, two. That's right. Well, Spencer only counts as one. He has to take both off to get it, but then you get a second oh, one. So roll again. Okay. Huh, you, 19, a magic item. Oh, snap. What you got? You got a... 16? A spell ring. There's one spell from the spell list when this item's found. The wearer of the ring may cast that spell as an action. Afterwards, the ring's destroyed. You have a one use spell from any spell list. No. So there you go, the ranger's getting away with the loot. Uh, I have to say, Lord Grey Fox, he was kind of in for himself, so it's very, very ironic that he found a sharpened butter knife in the, in the end <laughs> of it all. Um, but getting a cool spell ring for um, uh, the ranger named Slickback, and of course, um, Stefan Wolf managing to at least get away with his life. So I hope you enjoyed that. We'll see you have more ranger shot even in the future. Big thanks for Joe sending us the mission. You guys for playing. Talk to on Ash. Apple I hope you enjoyed that video. If you uh, want to support the channel, of course, like and subscribe and hit the little bell below so you get notifications when I post future content. I do post stuff seven days a week. Uh, if you want to support the channel um, further, you can, of course, buy a t-shirt through Spreadshirts, um, buy a measuring gauge or objective markers from Deathbird Designs, um, or, of course, most importantly, there is Patreon. Patreon is what makes all this possible, uh, keeps the lights on, pays for the studio costs, pays for the equipment, model costs, and everything else, and most importantly, um, puts food in my kids' bellies and a roof over their heads. Uh, big thanks to everyone past, future who supported me. Uh, I do this stuff because of you guys, and of course, I will continue doing it as long as I can.